Too. Well, speaking of the company, uh, another piece of news surrounding Harvey Weinstein, effective immediately, Hachette Book Group has terminated its imprint with Weinstein Books. A statement to the Hollywood Reporter reads, in quote, going forward, titles currently under Weinstein Books, including mine, will be published by our Hachette Books imprint, and the Weinstein Books imprint team will join Hachette Books. Now, if you've... Now, Amika, uh, you were one of the first people, obviously, you had a very, very big deal with Harvey, and you, you immediately said, this is something I'm not going to be a part of. What's the status as far as so, the books? And yeah, I, I said I have a three-book deal with Weinstein, not moving forward till he's fired. It didn't feel like enough when you read about the board and how many other issues. It was so convoluted. There's no way that people in inside the company didn't know um, and I was very clear that I would not go forward with the book um, so the until you get a sense that this behavior is <clears throat> completely intolerable and non-existence within a company now that they've split with Weinstein Hachette book group is 70 percent women the women that I work with uh, Amanda Murray and Georgina Levitt are amazing and I can't wait to work with them again I spoke to the CEO the very top guy at Hachette book group Michael Peach about the company's policies and the new structure how this is all going to work. We're going to have an ongoing conversation about sexual harassment and wage equity, and I'm really looking forward to writing about all of it in the re-release of Knowing Your Value and the two other books that I will be doing with Hachette Book Group. Good. I'm very satisfied. Yeah. Um, I'm just curious, was, did Harvey, would be the ultimate irony when your books, which obviously are about women empowerment, did Harvey ever give you these speeches about this is how great and we need this and I'm so proud to be doing these books? Well, the thing that was really upsetting to me is that he rushed to page six with my three book deal in the first place. So we're going to reannounce this partnership next week uh, without Harvey. By the way, after Mika told them specifically, I don't want press on this, I'm not ready for this. I need to get my authors together. I need to get everything else together. And he rushed to page six and leaked that she was getting this big three book deal to help women's empowerment. Interesting. So he was using it obviously for PR. I'll give you a Harvey Baxter. Ten years ago, about six or seven guys were going to get together by New York Magazine. Harvey was one of them. And I was in a room with him. And after a half hour, I was like, I'm not investing because every Every minute we'll be spending making sure he's not getting more than everybody else. Like our president, everything is about him and mm. how it affects him. And there are a lot of, I'm not calling our president a sexual predator, but there are a lot of parallels in the psyche of these two guys. You know, the thing, the, it's funny, you asked about like what we knew about him. What we knew about him was he always wanted something for nothing. Yeah, that was it. That's what I took He was always thing. pushing, 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 get this person on, that person on. Like, and I would add, it, it, Poor Ann Edelberg would always fill the calls. Yeah. And she'd come down and she goes, Harvey wants to do that. I said, Well, do we? She goes, He gives us nothing. It's always, you know, it's what I want this, I want this, I want this, I, I want I, this, I, I want I, this. I, I, and then I said, Well, how about we'll have so and so from the movie or from the documentary from the Oh no, they're not available. So that's what we knew about him was it was always push, 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 give me more, and he never, ever actually returned. Well, up next. Thanks for checking out MSNBC on YouTube and make sure you subscribe to stay up to date on the day's biggest stories. And you can click on any of the videos around us to watch more for Morning Joe and MSNBC. Thanks so much for watching.